Hello YouTube my friends, um, Alpha Papa Novi here, thank you for coming to my channel, please like and favor and comment on the video if you like it or if it helps you. Um, I'm going to be doing an unboxing of a um, Entec Believe It um, High Current Gamer 750 watts um, power supply, has a lot of connectivity, um, it has 24 pin connector for your motherboard. Um, this is going to be a built. I'm gonna build a Hackintosh. I barely got into the Hackintosh scene. I don't have that long, so I'm not a professional. I'm not an expert whatsoever. I do a lot of research and a lot of reading. So um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna aim for the best build that I can get. So it's gonna cost me a lot of money. It's just gonna cost me a lot of money. I'm not a rich guy, so I'm gonna buy the parts slowly and build it as I go. So, let's get to it. Um, this is the power supply. This is the box. This is the front of it. That's the front of it. Um, the side. Here we have the other side, in case you're interested in seeing this. The side, this other side, like this. Of, and we have this side, and if my cameraman can get close, so you can get a shot of all these letters if you guys want to read them. So this is going to be for a build. I'm going to use the i7-3770K, which is third generation processors, and I'm going to use the motherboard. Um, I am going to use the C68 XP UD5 LG 1155 socket. Um, so let's get to this baby. Let's open it up. Let's get inside the box. The plastic is coming off. plastic off the box is nice feels smooth I like how it feels doesn't feel cheap at all and let's try to get inside flip this off bring this off the end here we go this is what you'll see this is what you see inside as soon as you open your box some cardboard here really nice Really nice packaging. Um, I'm assuming everything is connected to the power supply right now because it should have, um, should be able to undo all these wires. Or maybe I bought the wrong one, which I probably did. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think this is the right power supply. This guy definitely gave me the wrong power supply, but it's a 750. Hmm. This is not the same power supply I want. I was trying to get, but oh well. We're already doing the unboxing, so. This is basically what you get inside. You get some screws, and this is are gonna be all the, the pins and the connections for the hard drives, the, the disk drive or the CD drive, this DVD burner, whatever you wanna call it. And this is the 24 pin connector. And this is how it looks in the inside. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Um, I don't really know if I want to keep this power supply or if I want to go back and because this was not what I was trying to buy. At least this is not what I intended to buy. I think the guy got confused and gave me the wrong box or something, but I can always go back to price and exchange it, so that's not a big deal. I just pretty farther from my house and uh, the gas is expensive. All right, welcome back, my friends. All right, my friends. Um, Have a basically great what day. happened was that I got Good the wrong time. power supply. There was two that looked similar. But they were totally different things. One was 650, the other one was 750. Um, and 
I thought the 750 was the one that I wanted, but it, was, it wasn't. So I went back and I bought this um, toolbox. <laughs> that was a joke, it's not a toolbox, it's, it's the power supply. <laughs> yeah, let's continue. Um, this is how it looks. This is what you're gonna get. Uh, this one cost $119 to be exact. So this is the front of it, the side, uh, main here in case you wanna read that. Uh, the other side, uh, so there's, <clears throat> and this is the other side, and this is a 850 uh, wax. Wax, what? Wax, yeah. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Get this plastic off. Now that we have the plastic off, we're gonna go ahead and put this, pull this up. This should come up, open it. This is what you're gonna get inside. Nice and neat. It's a nice box, by the way. I'm liking it. Um, so you're gonna have your standard manual. Not a big deal. Um, something to, um, for the noise cancellation, I'm assuming it's like a rubber, rubber, so you can like, when you install the power supply, we have a um, manual. Nothing, nothing out of this world. Just telling you basically how to install it. There you go, you can go through it if you want to. Then we have um, the cables, uh, power for like, um, power? Uh, two, four, six, uh, six pin connector. We have another one, six pin connector. And then, we have um, this, which I don't know what they're for. I'm pretty sure I'll figure it out if I read the manual. You have another one of this. Then you have a screws. You have your typical screws for the power supply. This will be for like your case door or whatever. We have um, Silica gel, so I, I'm a pretty sure so it doesn't get rotten or I don't know for what. And we'll put this on the side. <coughs> then we have a two, four, six, eight pin connector, PCI for your graphic cards. Two, four, six, another one for your graphic card PCI. Two, four, six, we have another one. This will be for like the power, for like the um, CD, uh, CD or DVD drive, whatever you have. Here we have another one, two, four, six. And power supply, I mean power supply, I mean the AC cord. Um, it's a 13A, 125B, and we're getting here to the good part, which is in here, if you guys can see it. And here we go, here we have it. Um, This will be for 20, a 24 pin connector. And this will be for your CPU, two, four, six, eight. That will be for your CPU. And then we have a, this one is so two, four, six, eight, which is the same, but it can't split in case you have a four pin connector, I'm assuming. And this is it. This is the power supply, full range. Basically, um, everything is detached. You can detach, um, you cannot touch whatever, whatever you're gonna need right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. Right there. It tells you PCI. Let me open it. Let me get it out of the, out of here. I didn't want to get it out of here, but because I'm not getting the motherboard till um, Friday because I ordered it on Amazon. Uh, PCIe, Perry Pilot SATA, same SATA, PCI, SATA, SATA. So here you have it, guys. It's the RX 850AE. I never tried this one, but I'm going to go ahead and try it after the epic fail of the other one that I went back to fries bought this one pretty sure I'll, I'll be all right it'll be it'll do me good for what i needed it
Well, there you have it, guys. Thank you for watching. Goodbye, my friends.